Here's a live look at the mountain camera where we saw that beautiful pic picturesque sunset as we are looking west as of right now. Looking a lot cooler. So if you are planning to go out to the UTEP Lady Miners game, it starts at 6 o'clock and it is going to be much cooler after the game ends about around 8.30. So make sure you do pack that jacket. Let's take a look at the currents across the area right now. Where we are sitting at 68 in El Paso, 58 in Albuquerque. And the sun is already down on that side of town, but 75 in Austin and 72 up in Dallas. We are looking a lot cooler, a lot warmer than what we saw this past week. 80 out there in Tucson. Here's what's going on. We got a high pressure system sitting right over four corners of America and a lot of dry air in place. Unfortunately for us, this is not going anywhere anytime soon, but this dry air helped out with ripping up that post-tropical depression, Raphael, out there in the Gulf. Like I said, dry air is not going anywhere anytime soon. Bigger story though, we are looking at a gradual warm up as we go into your Monday and Tuesday. Got a cold front that's gonna start rolling into the area Tuesday afternoon. This is Tuesday at 5 a.m. where we are gonna have those southerly winds. This is why we are gonna see relatively warmer temperatures as we go into your Tuesday. Tuesday evening, this is when that cold front starts blowing into the area. It's not here just yet. Winds are gonna start turning out of the west. And then as we go into Wednesday morning, we are gonna see the winds turn out of the north and it's gonna be a little bit cooler behind this. Mostly low end winds. We are not gonna see a 87 first alert with this. And then as we go into Wednesday afternoon, the winds start turning out of the west and these out of the east and things are gonna start warming up after Wednesday tonight. We are going to cool down to 43 in El Paso, 40, 37 up there in Las Cruces, and 28 up in Cloudcroft. As we look into tomorrow, we are looking at mostly low 70s across much of the area, 74 out there in Sunland Park. As we look into El Paso County, a little bit of the same, 74 almost all the way across the board, except 75 out there in San Elisario. As we look at the next seven days, brought to you by Mattress Firm, for your Veterans Day, we are going to top out at 73 in El Paso, and then 77 for your Tuesday. Cold front builds in as you go into Tuesday into Wednesday morning, and then things cool down, but that is going to be very brief as we are looking at Friday. 75 degrees, and then 74 in Saturday. As we look into Las Cruces, a little bit of the same, a little bit cooler up there, higher elevation. We are going to see the cold front roll in. We are going to start the day off at 36 degrees, and then as we close out the week, we are going to be looking a little bit warmer. Stick around for sports coming up after the break.